We got one. There he is. Got him. Threw that crab out, and he could not resist. Ooh. Oh my gosh, guys. All right, guys, what's going on? It is Caleb, AKA Kavar Tech Media, and welcome back to the YouTube channel, guys. We are out on the kayak today. It's been a while since we've been out on the kayak, and today what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be doing two different things. We're gonna be fishing live crabs over an oyster bed, and we're also going to be throwing artificial. Uh, I really want to catch um, a flounder, maybe even a redfish, speckled trout. I know all three of those are out here. It's just a matter of finding them. The only bad thing about today, or not necessarily bad thing, but uh, we don't have a strong tide movement right now. So I don't know how that's going to pan out, but we did walk this shoreline, as y'all can see right there, and we did find uh, probably about six or seven fiddler crabs and I even found a blue crab. So we're gonna start off throwing a artificial bait, the Savage Gear Shrimp, one of the best baits y'all can throw. You know, everything eats shrimp pretty much. So we're gonna start off throwing that. And as the day progresses, we're gonna actually start fishing some live crabs over some live oyster beds. I'm hoping that we can get a redfish or maybe even a sheep set. It's really cool fishing a oyster bed. Uh, we don't have too many here in Pensacola, but this is an awesome area. So that's going to be today's video, guys. Hope y'all do enjoy. It's a beautiful day out here. And yeah, you guys enjoy. All right, guys, this right here is the rig that we're going to be throwing. We just got 20 pound leader with a little octopus hook and a little split shot. It's all you need. And we're making our way over towards this reef now. And we're going to start dropping some live crabs and uh, seeing if we can't catch something, guys. Ooh. We got one. Got him, guys. We got him. Oh, we got him. Oh, yeah. We got him, guys. Oh, yeah. Don't know what it is. That did not take long. Did not take long, guys. Look at that. <laughs> that is so cool. Nice little red guy. That did not take long, guys. Now this ground right here is covered with oysters, so that is that is what is down there. He just came off the hook, actually. Thank God he was over the yak. There we go, guys. Check it out right there. I'm gonna go ahead and get some footage of that guy. All right, guys, well, that is the first fish, man. Like I said, this little area right here is covered with oysters. And that's what these little guys are trying to find food in. They're just rooting around those oysters. And uh, sure enough, man, you throw a live crab out there, these guys will <laughs> find it and they will crush it. It's one of their favorite baits. Let's go ahead and measure him up real quick. Not a big one by any means, but yeah, he's, he's probably about 17, probably about 17 guys. 16 and a half beautiful first fish man let's go ahead and get them back see you bubby all right first fish right there guys that did not take long man i'll tell y'all what it's panning out to be a good day let's go ahead and get another crab sometimes it's a little bit difficult fishing these oyster bottoms because you're constantly getting snagged and so you're having to determine whether it's a bite or not, but more times than not, they'll they'll bite it in a, in a way that you'll know for sure it's a fish. Ooh, guys, we are on. We are on, come on. Not on that time. There we go. Oh yeah. Oh, he came off, guys. He came off, man. Dang it, he came off. Oh, guys, that was a decent fish right there. This is so much fun. We gotta get another crab out there. Oh, oh my gosh, guys. Oh, this is a trout. 
Oh my God, if this is a trout, guys, this might be my PB. Dude, he ate a crab too. No way. Oh my gosh. No way, guys. Are you serious? Oh my gosh, it's a big trout on a crab. On a live crab, guys. I am not exaggerating. Holy cow, man. Are you serious right now? Oh my gosh. That was insane. Oh my gosh. As soon as I set the hook, I saw them flash. And that was 100% a trout flash. I cannot believe my eyes right now. Well, that just goes to show you that trout will eat a dead crab or a live crab. He was like halfway dead, I think, but y'all check out that freaking fish, man. That is a grown, grown speckled trout. Nice, guys. We're going to attempt to get him. <clears throat> He's barely hooked. Oh my gosh. Y'all, check out that speckled trout right there, man. Holy cow. Gonna wet my other hand. She's got some shoulders. That is for sure, man. Look at that trout. Ate a dead crab. I cannot believe that. That is insane. We're gonna get her on the bump board real quick. All right, she goes. 21 and a half inches guys 21 and a half inches y'all probably can't see that this right here is 21 this is 22 21 and a half nose is on the board wow what a fish i'm gonna get my other gopro out and get a better view of them man i cannot believe that Oh yeah, there she goes. Right back down to the bottom. <laughs> oh my gosh. Y'all, that was pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie. I did not expect to catch a speckled trout. Those speckled trout never fail to amaze me. <laughs> let's go ahead and get some more crabs out and let's catch something else, guys. Hopefully we can upgrade our redfish. If, if we can catch a big red, that would make today's trip done, set, made. So hopefully we can make it happen. Let's get a crab on, guys. Oh, there's a red fish right there, guys. No way. There's a red fish right on the beach. Oh my gosh, let's see. Oh my gosh, guys, if I can sight cast this fish, that will be insane. Come on. I think he's on. I got him, guys. No freaking way. Holy crap. Come on, please be on still. Oh my gosh. No freaking way. Oh my gosh. Guys, I saw that fish crawling up on shore, like literally on the beach almost, man. I saw his back out of the water this is a good one guys this is a good red man oh yeah oh yeah that is what's up guys i saw him right on the beach threw that crab out and he could not resist okay we gotta go chase him down though because i don't want him to go around this pole right here guys <sighs> Oh yeah, solid fish, really solid red right here. Right on the beach, man, how cool is that? Sight casting with a crab. That was, oh, tell y'all what, this year has been a really good year just for stuff that I've never done before in terms of fishing. It's been a really, really good year so far. I've never sight casted a redfish uh, using a crab before. It's definitely a first. If y'all watched uh, last video or a couple of videos ago, I'm not sure whenever I'll post this one, but I actually sight casted 
a speckled trout with a live mullet and that was a first so super super cool man but that is just a healthy healthy pensacola bay redfish right there man just a beautiful fish oh yeah just a gorgeous gorgeous red he's got some shoulders on him too guys that is a really really healthy redfish right there y'all check him out he's probably 26 or 27 right on the dot man <sighs> Oh yeah, y'all, check out that red, <laughs> woo, oh yeah, sight casted on the beach, man, how insane is that, uh, hook right in the mouth, golly, that right there is one of the coolest things that I've done, that was insane, guys, whoo. There he goes. Woo! Oh, man, guys, today is turning out to be a really good trip. I was not expecting that fish to even eat. Woo! That was insane. Let's go ahead and get some more baits out and uh, let's keep fishing, guys. We're having a great day. We've only been fishing for probably about maybe two and a half hours, and we already got a redfish that was probably around 17 inches, a 21 and a half inch speckled trout. And then I'm assuming that redfish was probably right at 27. He was definitely upper slot if he was. Um, but all right, guys, let's go ahead and uh, get another bait out. See if we can't sight cast another one. Big black drum right here, man. Big black drum, big black drum, big black drum. Oh yeah, come on. Guys, monster, monster black drum. Oh my gosh, he just ate my bait. He just ate my bait. Don't know if y'all can see him, he's right there. There he goes, we're gonna let him eat. We're about to be on literally two minutes from the last fish. I'm not even exaggerating. Oh, did he, s nope, he's still on. Oh no, oh my gosh. No, he came off. Oh, where'd he go? Oh my gosh. <laughs> that was a big ugly. Literally just sight casted a giant black drum. Oh, he came off, man. Oh my gosh, that was pretty cool. Dang it. The way he was swimming, I was casting about right at this angle and he swam towards my right but i gave him a lot of slack i just didn't set the hook fast enough guys that's just it's a dumb headed mistake did not set the hook fast enough oh man that sucks but we're gonna go ahead and uh, we might beach the yak real quick and try to catch some more crabs guys always make sure that y'all are drinking plenty of fluids whenever y'all are out here man it is out here it is boiling hot especially whenever there's no clouds in the sky and uh, that's something that you do not want to find yourself in. Never go kayak fishing and do not bring any type of fluids. I've been there, done that on accident, and it is not fun. But y'all check out the scenery. Just absolutely beautiful out here. Gorgeous. We're literally in the middle of nowhere right now. All right, guys, that is going to be the YouTube video. We just made it back to the house, and what a day on the water, man. That was one of the coolest days that I've had in a long time. You know, something I don't really do a whole whole lot of is uh, sight casting, let alone with some crabs. So that was uh, pretty interesting. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video. You know, it's something new. And uh, leave a comment down below what I should do next, guys. I'm always reading the comments, so... Uh, be sure to drop one down below. As always, be sure to leave a like. It does greatly help out the YouTube channel. Y'all might not think it does, but it really does. And as always, be sure to subscribe if you guys are new to the YouTube channel. Do stuff like this every single week. So, uh, yeah, that's it, guys. Hope y'all have a great day. Peace out and tight lines.